a house divided against itself cannot stand there is no way we can move forward or make progress if we don't put things in order if we don't set the record straight because a house that is divided do not have value and nobody want to associate with such a, a, a house so guys pay at close attention to this information because i suggest that the ngos and that is uh, uh, heads of uh, uh, organization they should put their house in order because for them to receive any money or for them to disperse money to the masses they need to get things right so guys listen to this information and stay informed make sure you subscribe and share this video let other people also take advantage through you because disbursement is sure and disbursement will come to pass and bye for now however please be aware that the delay is due to there are four things that uh, were itemized here and uh, I'm going to give us uh, the highlights of them. Number one, a high volume of applications requiring thorough review and uh, processing. Number two, complexity in verifying documentation submitted by applicants. And number four, ensuring compliance with newly implemented industry standards. And number four, coordinating with external parties for final approvals. Uh, they say we are diligently working to address these challenges and initiate the disbursement process as soon as possible. Your patience and understanding are greatly appreciated. And we got another one also which is uh, a little bit much more uh, welcoming than the former and this says that to all uag ngos and subscribers we are pleased to announce that the grand disbursement process is nearing completion I beg your pardon just one minute all right uh, to all uh, UAG NGOs and subscribers we are pleased to announce that the grant disbursement process is nearing completion we have worked diligently to resolve all outstanding issues and are now ready to release the funds and this is get your house ready disbursement can start at any moment and we urge you to prepare yourselves to receive the forms as soon as possible and then the further say please ensure that your account information is up to date your bank account is active and ready to receive the funds we do not want any further delays to occur due to incomplete or inaccurate information get your house in order now and be ready to receive your grant funds as at a moment's notice thank you for your patience and understanding sincerely uag authority this one came from uh one of the uh, uag uh channels that we have on telegram platform all right so uh, be it as it may we understand that um disbursement of uag is in high degree and uh, some actually says that uh, influencers are being paid to hype the process no that notion is not correct some of this information will also get to us are from the uaag channels where the information drops to every subscribers but some people don't have access to that so we that have access to that we can't just leave you in the loo we bring up those information for your fear you might not want it maybe because you have seen it there are some that don't even have the privilege to see it and they still have to see it through the channels or, or that they subscribe to uh, or on YouTube, on Facebook and the rest of them. So the fact that you have seen it or you have access to those information and others are bereft of that information does not mean that they should not also equally gain access to it. So all of these are not hyping, no they are just uh, an organ of information channel for us and there are times that apostle can we also drop information on those channels sometimes uh will drop information on those channels 
Pastor Biwabo and some of the allies connected to UAG and the rest of them like that drop information on those channels and uh, we deem it fit that the team population should be abreasted with whatever thing is going on so there are some information you feel are not uh, true but they are true you understand you with your own filter you, you dust them off but in the filter of UAG annals, they are actually not to be dusted off. They are part of the information that you need. Centrita drops it, uh, Supreme drops it, and the rest of them like that. So uh, we should please exercise some level of uh, patience and also comportment as we expect. All of us are stakeholders in this. All of us are beneficiaries and we're expecting that this grand disbursement should happen in no distant time. And by God's special grace, we're praying for the best that uh, no matter how long it takes or how far or how soon it is, that we'll get the best out of this. We have all waited and it appears like... Uh, uh, the rain is not going to fall but uh, uh, we are believing against hope that one of these days it will close chapter on talking about UAAG grant or close chapter on talking about Theobard Supreme Centrita and the rest of them and possibly some other grants that actually is going to be of benefit to Nigerians would come out so uh, I want to appeal to us to exercise a bit of uh, uh, patience and uh, if we believe in the process then we should keep on praying for the process to finally yield uh, appreciable increase for us and by God's special grace it will end in praise it will end in praise so uh, keep your hope alive and whatever it is that uh, UAG has for us or Theobat and the rest of them will be ready to receive them when the time comes so that's the information we have for us uh.